Tanner McAllister was the focus of the attention by the uh, transfer portal last year uh, based on his uh, skill on the field, but also his connection to Jim Knowles, of course. And uh, uh, Tony, you made uh, uh, you know a reference to the safety position and Sue brought up uh, she's interested in seeing these transfers and, and specifically to the defensive backfield between, uh, you know, the Syracuse and the Ole Miss transfers. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Davison Igbenosin started uh, 10 games last year for Ole Miss as a true freshman, started the first nine and then lost the job and then started in the bowl game. And I think an interesting thing, even when he was starting, he was still rotating. So he's accustomed to that. So you could see that continuing at Ohio State. I don't think he comes in and just – I don't think you pencil him in as a starter right now. I think there, there are too many other guys on this roster who are also itching to start. And, and what Tim Walton said about Denzel Burke is he's not a starter. He's a returning starter. So all of the jobs are still up for grabs. And uh, I, I don't think – I expect Denzel Burke to start. As to who is the, uh, the other starting corner, you could tell me any of those names, uh, be it – Jordan Hancock, Jair Brown, Davis, and Igbenosin. I wouldn't really be surprised if you asked me to bet on somebody right now. I'm probably going to take Jordan Hancock because he's the oldest. But, um, you know, it's Davis and Igbenosin starting that many games as a true freshman in the SEC. It's it's not nothing for sure. 